She wants her brother back, but she's also annoyed by her brother. This guy is kind of flirting with her, but while she's an, you know intrigued by him, she's not really in the same place as he is. There's so many wants on her. And, you know, she sticks to the one true want, which is she could have whatever she wants. She could live in her fantasy or fairy tale, but she knows deep down that she needs to rescue her brother. Like that is what is right and good, even though in the moment it would be great to get rid of this brother who in some of the descriptions of this movie, it's like her annoying brother. It's like that's a straight up baby. There's nothing <laughs> annoying about that kid. That That is a child who is crying because he is a baby. And the fact that she even comes in and reprimands a baby for taking a stuffed animal, I'm like, whoa, chill out. It's a baby. It's not even, it's barely a toddler, which makes it even more frightening when David Bowie has this baby in his lap or the baby is surrounded by like these goblins. Like that is probably one of the best (laughs) scenes I've ever seen in a movie. Like just a baby in PJs surrounded by a room of fucking goblins and is frightened (laughs) out of its mind. I think perversely, the baby seems happier with the goblins Then with his sister, he's like, my sister's scary and she's yelling. These goblins are pretty fun. 